Hey welcome back out in the stretch, Professor. Let's go ahead and get back in here. So, I managed all of the buildings here. This is a little concerning. This guy might step out. We could hire a lord. Just hire a bunch of stuff next turn if we want to. We can send him back if we want to. But I think right now, just knocking out... Um, knocking out this rebel army is probably one of the better options. Um, over here, we might be able to take out Itza. We'll see. This army is very expensive. Um, they have some good features, but I went ahead and canceled the stuff on Itza except for the upgraded money. Because I think we're going to, first order of business is come back over here and reconquer this stuff. We might have to deal with this chaos dude. Um, but it's a looks kind of weak. They might hire another army there. I don't know. So I just didn't want to invest the money right now on the um, the expansion stuff. I just the purple expansion stuff because I'm probably going to be coming through here anyways. Moo Kip is also sort of knocking on our door. Um, we could potentially is that for Skaven too? Um, we could potentially jump this wall and just go after Moo Kip. So. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. But I figured that's just how we'd run that. It's not really long term. Um, I don't know. Why did I even put this here? I think I inherited that. Deeper Tunnel is level 2. But anyways, okay. So I think what we're going to do with uh, Snitch here is... I'm just going to grab this Death Squad... Just come knock these clowns out, hopefully. Damn. Yeah, we should just be able to ambush right murder. Then. Yes, yes. Murder staff. Good in the food. Give money by <laughs> get soldiers. Price cost is <laughs> is reasonable. Time to move. Okay. Got them out of there. Can we actually hold Karakazul? Right, I think contract loopholes. All ranks, all heroes. That's pretty. That's pretty legit. Um, night runners and gutter runners plus ten percent infantry. Scurry fast. Immediately cause siege attrition at a reduced rate when besieging enemy enemy settlements. Okay, so they it just basically attrition's everything a little bit. He didn't get Ancient Cunning, which is supposed to be the Master Ambusher. So, you know, we talked about that before. It's pretty good skills. It's not perfect, but it's it's pretty good for AI. But yeah, I think this Contract Loopholes is just what we have to do here. Rat Foo. And then these are... Huge success chance, ambush success chance. Isn't there one over here? It's like extra ambush. Jump scare is too. Okay, so I think we have to have contract loopholes. Yes, yes. And then how? These guys are pretty strong. I don't. We don't have a good squad to deal with them yet. Now, I did notice that over here at Crookback, he does actually have um, a Tier 4 Weapon Squad team, which is great. But we don't have the Workshop. So I'm putting the Workshop in a Tier 3 town because we kind of need all of these. We found out we have a Level 5 Warp Zone Reactor here too for Ingenious Plans, so we don't have to build that in our main town. And we have um, this is all the way up, which is good. Um, 
And then we need this as well. Just we need as many storm vermin as we can get. And then this gives us extra three plague monks. So I didn't want to get rid of that because we can put that in our um, other place. So that's pretty handy. And then of course we want this so we can hire these and so we get an extra cap on them. Nah. So yeah, the only place to really put it then, the workshop is over here. Now that's not gonna let us hire a, um, it's not gonna let us hire an engineer over here, which kind of sucks, but. Nah. Nah. She needs to be muzzled. Might as well just grab two slaves. Okay, and I think we're just going to have to let this go. The dwarves are probably going to clean this up, so we'll wait on that. Assassin. And I figured out, how can I find Tretch? Because I was like, do I just run an assassin all the way up there? What I could do is try to military ag ally with Hog Grave, Ready. who is at war with them. So that would probably allow me to spot them. And then I could potentially um, military lines with them. But I want to check with... Um, I want to check with Queek after... See if we can confederate with Queek. Because Queek's going to be better than Tratch, probably. But I'm not sure if Queek's going to go for it. So that's what we'll do with that. And I'm trying to decide, you know, what do I want to do with the assassins? They aren't that expensive, though. Even just using them as scouts, just to kind of see what's what's up, could be handy. But then there's any heroes in like any of these armies, we can just start picking apart. Call me me, death master. <laughs> yeah, and then we just kind of optimized everything over here that we needed to be doing. Murder job. It does give us success chance on everything, too. The 5% success chance on everything is pretty good. So we're just going to go ahead and get ingenious plans here. Um, a little more food. Well, if we're going to hold on to that tier 5 building, I guess we'll go with this. I am a little bit worried about um, some of those places getting sacked over there. But I can hire a lord and then just spam a bunch of units if we need to. And we did get to Supreme here. Like I said, we're going to get to that pretty fast. Because um, we have so much stuff. So that gives us diplomacy with all factions. But everything costs 25% more to recruit. Upkeep is plus 25%. And I think that's going to trigger the second Chaos event. Maybe. They might have to wound Archeon first. But it, it's coming pretty quick. Do we want to upgrade these or... I guess we'll let these tunnels come in. It could be a waste of money, but if we're going to be able to sack them, we can just sell them, I guess. Yes. She asked you for what sounds like muscle. Yeah. And muzzle? It's Marshall the Paw Patrol. Oh. That took about five minutes. <laughs> okay. It's like, oh, where's my muscle? Like muscle, what are you talking about? Excellent. Can you play games? Dang, they like that we're killing everybody. Yeah, we Your abasement pleases me. <laughs> Your abasement pleases me. Erica Dream likes us, sort of. Red Eye and Bloody Hands, or sort of whatever. Okay. Well, we could Cast trade with the Awakened if we really psyche. wanted to. I mean, I kind of want to kill them. They only have one town, though. The, the Awaken, is that one of the things we can get, though, as a victory condition? Yeah, okay, so we need to just kill them. Because we have to get a bunch of these. There we go. They're 
always just feels like you're forgetting something once you get this many properties. And honestly, you probably are. <laughs> Cold blood will still boil. Let me show you. Nah, bro. Might regret that at some point. Deal with me or fight me. You will gain no nothing but misery. Did they gain? Okay. Okay, so they gain control of this. Okay, I mean, I don't want to fight him right now. It's fine with me. We could pop over and clean up this stuff now without having to worry about Red Eye up there. Probably. Yeah, sure, I've got something else to do. Y'all can live for a little bit longer. Skaven may not like that. There's a couple of factions that may not like that, actually, but I really don't want to have to deal with them up there. Confederating. They hired another ward. It, it's a. Uh... How much backdooring can these little dwarves do? These guys took Iron Rock. Do they even have any towns left? The dwarves? The proper dwarves? No, they have no towns. So they're taking attrition right now if they don't take a town. Okay, what else in the events? Demoed a bunch of stuff. Where is this? Eight hundred and thirteen upkeep. No, it's just too many stupid skills. No malice. I do have that powder keg also. no movement in the jungle. Gosh, how much extra... Should be getting a lot of extra movement range just off of random buffs we have around the map. I guess he doesn't have this guy yet. I only have one more turn of steel tech, too. So we gotta get these weapons teams upgraded. We have to have those to combat. They're just like to siege and fight the lizardmen down here. I am the Lord. Okay, so we could run back and forth or we could just go and like ambush here. I see you. Prepare, unleash 
Are there any techs that give um, ambush chance? I think this does. Eyes everywhere, yeah. Could also go for forced march. Do minus four food. Oh my god, how are we consuming that much food? Holy. What's, what's eating that much food? 70 from settlements. 30 from under empire. Okay, so we're at a huge deficit on buildings. I thought I was like building food out everywhere. Rating, we're getting a little bit, and techs, we're getting a little bit, but. Jeez. Okay, we gotta we gotta fix that food situation then. I've been building up food like basically everywhere. Just about. Never. I guess some of these main towns are really expensive. They eat like two food. We do have several techs that can give us food. Just all of these little generic um, ones give us food. So we can get six more food per turn off of the techs. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, so he's coming back to try to deal with us. His rating is it 25 or 50? It's 25. Okay. So we could like raid this, maybe? Yeah. Oh, that's their property line. Oops. Okay. Hey, do they really get? Oh, I really hope they don't make me seize that. Master engineer. Okay, so we're just gonna start fighting them up there just so we have some money going. And then... I kind of want to take out Iron Rock. My axe for war. Oh, Matorka does have walls. Yes, good call for me to put walls on that. They're probably going to go down here for Zvorg whatever, though. Never. They have almost nothing, though. I mean, if they try to step to this, I could just hire a lord and get those regiments of renown. Enough to kill him. I will not. Does this guy have anything? Stop that. Can they actually take this? I doubt it. Okay, so we don't need to overreact here. What? Well, green skins might retake some of this stuff. How are these dudes moving? I can't see them right now. Don't think so. Snitch. Yes. Could pop over with Snitch. Grab like Black Iron Mine. <laughs> Safer play is just to complete this province. Dakaraz looks like it has walls. Science, sorcery, death. Because we're not at war with Iron Rock, although they will probably come at us pretty soon. Now this place does have um, for the wisdom of Valaya. I mean, we can beat them in a big siege. That's fine. Let's just let's knock out Dakaraz. They have walls. No walls, I don't think. Orc guardhouse. Yeah, it does have walls. You know, whatever, though. Let's just fight it. Bros, you don't stand a prayer. Murder! Death! Kill! Yeah, we're gonna have to 
do something with that food topic. situation, though. I mean, I just put up food everywhere. It's pretty much what, what I'm doing. And with the Eshin guy, we do have enough to, um... We can't hire the weapons teams yet, but we can step back, grab a couple of um, abominations... I think of what else we can get a drill. Oh, we can't do a ton of weapons teams. We just, we need weapons teams everywhere. I mean, there's only just so many that we have with the cap system, so we gotta be careful. We're a little bit greedy with this army, like the. Should maybe get rid of one of these mortars. But it's already like everything's such a high level. I feel like I'm committed to keeping it. Even though it is a bit greedy. Very greedy with um, the storm vermin, too. I don't know that we need all that. We really need. But we're kind of committed to it, these guys already. We really need the Storm Vermin um, in Lustria with the Halberds against the um, Wizardmen. Drills are not capped, so that's fine. Our tile's yours. Storm Vermin! Was this little unit? Oh, the drills. Yeah. Okay, so they're just not even putting anyone on the rafters, so, so they're mixing it up a little bit here. Is magic damage also there? Okay. This map is a lot bigger than you would immediately think. Okay, we're get, kinda getting close. Time to go! Go! Quick! Quick! Boy, 
And the near rockets moving. Move! It does look super cool. 
like the, the shrapnel blast. Now that I understand what's going on and it's not glitched, it actually does look pretty sweet. Just like so good at just murdering huge blobs of infantry. It had over a thousand. It's one dot dot dot. That's a good kitty. You are being very good, aren't you, Sadie? You're a good cat. She says, we'll see about that. Bruh. I don't remember now. if we had enough movement. I, th Take I think we should have Spots enough. In Alright, just throwing down some food everywhere. No Rat, wolf, Rat wolf assassin. <sighs> Strategist talisman. I mean, he's immortal. I guess we can give him a smaller one, the Luck Stone. We don't need this Helm of Discord, though. We can put that on somebody else. Have some Gambor's armor. Now, who's going to be running a lot of melee? It's probably him. I am the Plague Lord. This rat is no okay, so Warpstone armor is a good one. That's doubling down on the damage. Uh, I guess we can give him that. Dragon Helm. Yeah, we'll give him Helm of Discord. Wait, why not? actually does not allow him to do it. That's weird. Okay, let's give him that, and then maybe it can only go on... No, That's really weird why they would show it, but not. I don't know. Okay, and then the Pigeon Plucker is actually relevant because they might have some flyers. These guys don't, but it's possible they could get some flyers. Okay, we've moved him... Contract taken. Okay. Now that, um, don't need to upgrade that. Get our other armies moving. Okay, so we moved him, moved Arkling, moved Skrulk, Snitch. We have to Master decide. Um, now, how long on this? We need food. Here's the food. And then. Oh, that's eating food, too. Okay, so there are some other of these, like, high-end buildings that also eat food. Okay, so we need to come over here and probably just get some weapons teams together so we can go siege. Death Master and that means we're going to be letting um, 
I'm gonna be letting Carrick Azul go, which is probably okay. I'm gonna go ahead and close these guys out. Kind of one of the number one orders of business. What is this? Desolation of Nagash. Okay. Lord of the Assassins. Okay. I guess we'll hold this because they could come out with some stuff. Uh, I kind of want to delete some of these just to save some money, but they're very cheap on him anyways. Okay, so that's all of our people that have moved. Okay. Okay, Magrita. Get that, and I guess just one of those. I mean, we might as well get this. Trade's not going to matter, most likely, but... I don't like how it doesn't show you the underway stuff, though. Okay, Flayed Rock. What are we doing over here? Um... Could do a Weapons Depot... I don't know what I got rid of. That seems a bit expensive. How long until we get the discount? Eight turns. Could go ahead and get a weapons pit, and then once we get the discount, we can get this. That would give us one more weapons team. I guess having a couple of these assassins wouldn't be terrible. Yeah. No, I want what? I'm recording. This will pay for itself. It does give us some movement in the area. I guess 1,000 is not that. I thought it was 2,000. Okay, so we can just go ahead and get that for 1,000. Yeah, we'll just do it that way. And then we can upgrade it when we need to, eventually. Okay. Um, Sartosa is fine. We can wait for the upgrade on that. Skaven Blight's fine. Yeah, we can just wait on upgrades. Of that stuff. We're already maxed on assassins. I have a million sorcerer slots. Um, we don't need any of those. Okay, so we can do another under empire. And we can just use one of these guys to start an under empire, probably. We don't have a guy that's like scouting right now. Um, we need this guy to help us siege, so we're not going to be able to do an under empire there. Where else can we hire an under empire? Um, or a dude? Can't hire any over here, I don't think. We have weapons team, which does not allow us to hire, I don't think. And then we have to have an upgrade engineering place. Does the place have any upgrade engineering? We can't hire them over here, right? That won't let us hire anywhere. Haunted Forest. Yeah, we need we need engineering places then, so we can hire some engineers over here. 
I guess Fortress of Vorog would be the place we'd go for that. We just can't fit it in here. I mean, unless we get rid of this, which I don't want to do that. I suppose we could hire one here and then um, start them down here we just start some stuff down there somewhere maybe on Henry I should have thought of that beforehand, but there's just like a million different things constantly trying to do here. And we can eventually walk him over there with Snitch, I guess. Yeah, I should have thought of that beforehand, that it's just... Because you need a Tier 4 building. It's we, we can hire a bunch of them, but we can't hire them in certain places. Okay. So that's what we'll do there. We might be a little late to post those up, but... Derek DeWaz bag. Sure. We'll go ahead and start that right on that. What is it, dear? A little bit. What do you need? Okay, probably like 10 or 15 minutes. It's a, so, I mean, we might as well. We're gonna protect it. Eric Azul's probably going down. Silver Road vaults. Okay. Eric Azor. Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Like I said, sorry. It's managing all this crap and Crown etching assassinating I'll just keep a uh, keep an eye out there okay silent killer yes yes wait was there gonna be a rebellion somewhere oh hold on this also yes this I don't know why I didn't set this up earlier I forgot about it. I think. Did I upgrade all of these already? And the Elf Woods, we were thinking about upgrading, but. Waterfall Palace is upgraded. Might I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to hit these or not. I mean I guess I can cancel them if we need to. Go ahead and invest in that. I think all these other ones we've done. Kira Kiern. Okay. How are we losing more food? I thought we were green on the food. I'll be back in one second. Let me just grab a... This quick fast, I'm busy. All right, 
What we got? He's already at war with Tretch, so he can't keep going to war with Tretch. You know what? Sure, I'll take it. Freaking clown, coward, dwarfs. Oh, the greenskins don't have any armies. That's what it looks like. So many red armies over here. Yeah, that's annoying, but whatever. Need to see what else is going on over here. Tor Elir. Where is it? Is that completed? Or Tor. Okay, so that's not a big one. We do need the food. We could just start throwing down food everywhere in all these places. It's hard to turn down money. I mean, we need money also. Classic food money purple. Jeez. This dude is coming for me. Alright, let's go ahead and get this ambush out of the way. Why is it not 13? Come on, where's the flavor? Alright, the warp stone could be okay. I think ancient cunning is where we just need to get that cost down. This army is just so expensive. It's like 9,000. I am the plague lord. <laughs> Seek out plague. Take the Walk, 
Warlock engineer. Guitar, please. Fire and smoke, okay. In, in the so we could just go with plague. We could also just, I think onslaught's pretty big. Six percent. I thought it was eight percent. With beastmen, I think it's eight. But power reserve, army wide's pretty good. Experienced Quell. We have enough spells. We don't need Plague. I mean, Plague's good for sieges, but. 5 leadership, 5 melee attack, bonus versus infantry. Doesn't have any armor or melee defense, but. Right, so we're about to fight those Lizardmen. Let's make sure we have stuff. So that lasts 36 seconds. This lasts 40 seconds. I'm not sure which one's supposed to be better, but. Okay, we'll go with that. And then so these guys burned everything over here. I don't even think I want that province. Star Tower, that's not a place that we need, is it? I don't think so. Awakening, Lothar and Lamia, Caracate Peaks. I thought he had Caracate Peaks. Oh, no, never mind. Kaza, uh, Kara is a Kara. That's what I was thinking of. Okay. Warp lightning! Okay, so we could just ambush them. And probably kill them and get Baird Bar in the same turn. Yeah, these guys are going to try to backdoor... Who is this? Is Queek? Yes, yes. How much longer on the Ken Confed? Seven turns. Chieftain of the God, Deep they have Warrens. ten properties also. Okay, so we have a Confederation penalty. They don't like the Hog Grave thing. Perhaps Claw Pact possible? Just need some security. You have relatives? <laughs> I mean, we don't have to have him. If we got Nagaron, though, that would help. Yeah, he's... Okay, so he's not nearly as uh, friendly with us. Lower your muscle and bask in glow of my brilliance. Think. Mm, it looks like we may not be able to even make alliances with Clan Moors. Military alliances. We'll see. Okay, so... Okay, yeah, let's just kill the dwarves. Now these guys are gonna go take out Varric de Wazbag and then we're gonna play musical chairs with him probably for a little bit. He I don't know what's what's up with him. We might be able to beat that if we just summon a bunch of rats. Test subjects! Damon Wright's greatest, best inventor! Who are they at war with? Onward! Greenskins, Chaos. Okay. Warp power! Yeah, 
consumes you. <laughs> Spoils pay for destruction. Arrivo. Skaven Blight revels in this victory. We're at 55. Okay, I think this... We'll start off the next episode. We'll siege this. You know, I'll turn it up to two or three times speed. We should be able to just massacre them. Um, and then we will start probably powering up Snitch. Get him a few um, weapons teams unit. A couple of, of uh, abominations. Pimp him out. And then we'll take out the green skins and start working our way um, over there. I don't know if it's Magical Islands where Hog Grape is. Those little islands down there. Um, we could go for Lamia. That is one of the places. I mean, if we can't confederate with Queek, we might just have to kill him. We'll see. We'll go through Karakazul and just kind of see what's going on with Queek. Um... And then, I, I don't know, we could send Ikit up north and have, um, just have the assassin guy come up and clean up the rest of the greenskins if we wanted to, if we want to start sending Queek into, um, Empire territory after we finish this up. We'll see. Anyways, um, that's going to be it. As always, thank you very much. Special thanks to everyone that sponsored this campaign. I really appreciate it. If you'd like to sponsor a campaign yourself, just email me at thestrategyprofessor@gmail.com. Let me know what you have in mind, and I'll see you next time. Have a great day.